In the height of COVID-19 last year, it was announced that there would be funding cuts of 50% to all of the Green King IPA Championship teams over the next couple of seasons. Bedford Blues are one of those 11 teams. Look, we understand where the game is, but we do find it incredibly challenging and immensely frustrating that the RFU have not valued the championship because, you know, current funding of 108, uh, 148,000, which is actually the RFU and PRL funding, uh, means that it's not sustainable to run, you know, nowhere near a full-time env environment. And to be honest, it wouldn't be allowable to run a part-time environment if it wasn't for our fantastic supporter base. The Championship isn't just the only talking point in rugby at the moment, with the Gallagher Premiership set to be ring-fenced, meaning relegation could be suspended until the 2024-25 season, with the possibility of having 14 teams in the division. Um, the problem, I think, is really on the promotion, more the demotion down from the Gallagher, because I think if there is nothing to lose, then the incentive goes out of the rugby a little bit, um, certainly at the lower level, certainly the sort of bottom four or five sides. It doesn't matter if they come bottom because they're not going to be going dropping down. However, with everything that is currently going on in rugby union, Bedford Blues have benefited from a partnership with Premiership team Northampton Saints that they secured in June 2020 that allows them to take Saints players, including academy players, on loan, as well as giving opportunities to young Northampton Saints coaches. To be honest, it's been an absolute lifeline to us and we're very lucky the relationships from Saints, from the chairman to the CEO to the director of rugby, uh, they're all fully invested uh, and then down into the academy and their coaches. So it has been a lifeline to us. Um, it is very much part of our forward planning with the current funding situation. Rugby union in the UK is currently going through a turbulent time with a lot of uncertainty resonating throughout all the divisions. Teams in the lower leagues, the championship and the premiership have all been impacted by COVID-19, financial worries and new rules that clubs will have to adhere to. However, with all the current talk and everything that is set to happen, clubs like Bedford continue to push on with their season well underway. They will focus on the future and look to finish it in a strong position by the end of the campaign.